Are you holding on to a 1963 Lincoln penny right now? Maybe it's sitting in your collection, gathering dust, or maybe it's hidden in a drawer somewhere. Well, if it is, I have some life-changing news for you. That simple penny could be worth up to $2 million. Yes, you heard that right, millions. So, stop what you're doing, grab that coin, and let's dive into why this seemingly ordinary penny could turn your financial future around. But hold on, you might be thinking, is this guy serious? A penny worth millions? Stick around, because I'm going to show you exactly why this 1963 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny is one of the most coveted and valuable coins in the entire coin collecting world. Let's start with the basics. The 1963 Lincoln penny. At first glance, it seems just like any other penny you've seen in your lifetime, bronze, small, and easily overlooked. But there's one key thing that makes it stand out, IN 1963. Most of the pennies struck by the US mint had a mint mark, either in D for Denver or an S for San Francisco. Here's the catch, the 1963 penny without a mint mark was struck in Philadelphia. However, this one tiny difference, this subtle error, is what makes this penny so valuable. And I'm not talking about a couple hundred bucks here. We're talking millions. But why? You'll find out in a minute that it's kind of like that one cousin of yours who shows up at family reunions in a fancy car. You know, the one you didn't think had anything going for them, and suddenly they're flashing money like it's no big deal. That's what this 1963 penny does to the world of coin collectors. And trust me, you'll want to know why. Now, here's where things get really interesting. This 1963 No Mint Mark penny isn't something that just anyone can find. In fact, it's considered one of the rarest pennies you could come across. So, if you've been holding on to one, you may have struck gold without even knowing it. Here's the thing, because these rare pennies are so scarce, they become highly desirable to collectors and investors who are willing to pay top dollar for them. When something is rare, its value skyrockets. Imagine walking into a room full of collectors, and there, shining in your hand, is the coin they're all fighting over. That could be you. But there's a twist. What if I told you that this rare penny might be hiding in plain sight, and you didn't even know what you had? You see, the market for rare coins is more intense than ever. And the most sought after 1963 no mint Mark Lincoln pennies have sold for up to $2 million. Yes, million dollar deals happening right now. So, how do you know if your penny is one of them? Stay tuned, because in just a few moments, I'll tell you exactly how to spot this rare gem and avoid making the kind of mistakes that could cost you big time. Trust me, you do not want to miss this. So, how do you spot a valuable 1963 no mint Mark penny among your collection? Here's what you need to look for. First, take a close look at the date. Does it say 1963? If yes, you're on the right track. Now, check the reverse side, the back of the coin. If there's no mint mark anywhere near the bottom, and the penny looks pristine with no signs of wear or damage, you might just be holding onto a gold mine. But here's the kicker. Most of the valuable coins are the ones that are in mint condition. That means little to no wear, a clear and crisp image of Abraham Lincoln, and well-defined edges. The cleaner the coin, the higher the price tag. But wait, what if your coin doesn't look perfect? Is it still valuable? The answer might surprise you. Even coins with minor imperfections can fetch a significant price depending on the rarity and demand. Now, I know what you're thinking. Wait, is this like looking for a needle in a haystack? Well, kind of. But what if you're the person who finds the needle? That's the exciting part, right? But there's one thing you must avoid when selling your coin, one mistake that could cost you everything. Most people make it, and they have no idea they're doing it that don't go anywhere. I'll tell you exactly what this mistake is, and how you can protect yourself from losing a fortune. Now that you know how to spot a valuable 1963 no mint mark penny, let's talk about selling it. Here's where most people get it wrong. The first step is knowing who to sell to. Sure, you could try selling it on eBay or through a random online marketplace, but you're risking getting ripped off. I'm talking about experts, coin dealers who know what they're looking for and are willing to offer top dollar. But before you head to a coin dealer, there's something crucial you need to do. Get your coin authenticated. Having it professionally graded can add value and ensure you're getting a fair price. Without it, well, you could lose out on thousands, even millions of dollars. Now, here's the part you've been waiting for. 
I'm going to give you the exact steps you need to take to make sure you get top dollar for your 1963 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny. But before I reveal that final secret, let me ask you this. What would you do if you found out your coin was worth a million bucks? Would you sell it? Would you buy a new house? Travel the world? Or live the life you've always dreamed of? Now, if you're feeling excited and ready to take action, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. You won't want to miss our next video, where I'll walk you through the exact process of selling your coin for the highest value. And who knows? This time next week, you could be living the lifestyle of your dreams. What if I told you that a single penny, minted over 50 years ago, could be worth up to $1.9 million? That's not a typo. A 1968 D. Lincoln penny could change your life. Sounds unbelievable, right? But it's true. In this video, we're diving deep into the value of this rare coin and how you can cash in on it. Stick around, because by the end, you might just find out you've been holding a treasure in your pocket this whole time. Let's take a step back. The year is 1968. The United States was in the midst of a cultural revolution. The Vietnam War was raging, and the world was changing fast. Yet, while the nation was shifting in ways we couldn't imagine at the time, one small, seemingly insignificant coin was quietly being produced at the Denver Mint, a coin that would later become a gold mine for collectors. The 1968 D. Lincoln penny is one of those rare gems that was minted with a subtle mistake, making it one of the most sought-after pennies today. The D. Mint mark is crucial here, and I'm sure you're wondering, why is that D. so important? Well, the Denver Mint used a die that was slightly worn, leading to a distinct flaw, a doubling in the number on the coin's reverse side. This was a rare mistake, and it wasn't something most people would have noticed back then. But today, that mistake is worth millions. If you have one of these pennies lying around, it could be sitting in your pocket, ready to make you a fortune. But here's the catch, you can't just rely on luck. You need to know exactly what to look for, because not every 1968 D penny is worth a fortune. Now, before you start raiding your couch cushions or your spare change jar, let's be real for a second. This isn't like finding a quarter that's worth a dollar because it has a cute little misprint. We're talking about big, serious money. We're talking about an amount that could change the direction of your life. So, don't get too excited and start calling it Penny Day just yet. So, what makes this coin so special? To the untrained eye, the 1968 D. Lincoln penny looks just like any other penny. It's copper with Abraham Lincoln's profile on the front and the Lincoln Memorial on the reverse. Nothing too flashy about it, right? But here's where things get interesting. The real value comes from the die variety. To spot this rare, valuable penny, you need to look for what's called double die obverse. This means that the image on the penny has been doubled due to a misalignment of the die during the minting process. This results in a blurry, doubled effect on Lincoln's face and the date. Now, I know what you're thinking. How do I even spot that? It's simple. Get yourself a magnifying glass or a jeweler's loop and start examining your 1968 D pennies. Look closely at the date, Lincoln's hair, and the letters on the coin. If you see a doubling effect, you could have a rare, high-value penny in your hands. But don't go running to the nearest coin shop just yet. There's more to the story, and here's where things get really exciting. Now, here's the thing. Not all 1968 D pennies are created equal. Some are worth a couple of bucks, while others could fetch you hundreds, thousands, or even millions. Stick around to find out exactly what makes a 1968 D penny worth the big bucks, and how you can sell it for top dollar to so what's the magic number for this penny. The coin's condition plays a huge part in determining its value. If your 1968 D penny is in pristine, uncirculated condition, you could be looking at a coin worth over $1.9 million. That's no exaggeration. But there's a catch. Only a few of these coins have ever been found in such mint condition. Let me hit you with some real numbers. The highest known sale of a 1968 D penny in perfect condition went for $1.9 million. And it wasn't even from a collector's stash. It was discovered by an ordinary person like you and me. But don't think you need to have a flawless coin to make a huge profit. Even coins in lower grades can fetch thousands of dollars. Here's where the urgency comes in. Coin collectors are constantly scouring for rare pennies, and if you wait too long, the market could change. What if I told you that this is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity? These coins are becoming harder and harder to find, and demand is growing. If you want to cash in on your penny, 
Now is the time. But before you start selling off your entire collection, let me ask you this. Are you sure you haven't already thrown away a fortune? I know it's hard to believe, but many people don't even realize what they have until it's too late. It's not like they're handing out million-dollar pennies at the grocery store.so. Now that you know about the value of the 1968 D. Lincoln penny, what are you going to do about it? You have the knowledge, the opportunity, and the power to turn a simple penny into a life-changing amount of money. Don't wait for someone else to find your treasure. Get out there, examine your pennies, and who knows? You could be the next lucky person to cash in on a coin worth millions. That simple, humble penny sitting in your drawer could be worth up to $1.8 million. Sounds crazy, right? But it's true, and if you're not careful, someone else could scoop it up for a fraction of its real value. Imagine finding out you had a rare coin all along, only to miss the chance to cash in. Well, stick with me because in this video, I'm going to show you how a 1978 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny could change your life and help you live the wealthy lifestyle you've always dreamed of. Don't blink. This could be the best investment you make this year. Let's start with the basics. In 1978, the U.S. Mint produced millions of Lincoln pennies, but here's the kicker. Most of these pennies are worth just one cent. But if you've ever come across a 1978 Lincoln penny with no mint mark, that's where the magic happens. Now, most pennies from that year were minted in either Philadelphia, Denver, or San Francisco, and each mint facility places a tiny mint mark on the coin. But in 1978, something extraordinary happened. A small number of these coins were released without a mint mark, and that's where the value begins. These missing mint marks are rare. Some experts estimate that fewer than 50 of these pennies exist in perfect condition. But what's so special about them? What if you could sell one of these for hundreds of thousands? Maybe even millions? That's right. Some of these rare pennies have sold for as much as $1.8 million at auctions. That's a huge jump from the face value of just one cent now. Let's talk about how you can spot a 1978 No Mint Mark penny in your own collection. Here's where things get serious. To find this hidden treasure, you need to pay close attention. Most of the 1978 pennies you'll find on the market are not the rare ones. They have the mint marks, or they're just standard pennies that didn't stand out. But the 1978 No Mint Mark coin is often overlooked. What if you have one right now? What if it's been hiding in plain sight for decades? The first step is to get out your magnifying glass and carefully examine your pennies. Look at the obverse, the side with Abraham Lincoln's portrait. If there's no mint mark, and it's from 1978, congratulations, you might be holding something worth far more than you ever imagined. But don't just take my word for it, the market is on fire right now. Collectors are willing to pay top dollar for these elusive coins, especially in perfect condition. And if yours is in pristine condition, you could be sitting on a fortune. You thought your coin jar was full of useless junk? Think again. What if your next trip to the bank gets you a small fortune instead of a handful of pennies? Wouldn't that be a good surprise? So, now that you know the potential of the 1978 No Mint Mark penny, what's next? Well, you can't just leave this to chance. If you want to cash in on your discovery, you need to act fast. This isn't something you can sit on and wait for. It's about seizing the moment. The market for rare coins is only growing. Auctions are setting records. A coin you hold today could be worth even more tomorrow, but it could also slip through your fingers if you're not careful. Timing is everything. Those who sell their rare coins at the right moment are the ones who make millions. Imagine walking into an auction room with a 1978 No Mint Mark penny and watching the bidding soar, starting at a few hundred dollars, then climbing to thousands, then, well, you saw it coming, dollar 1.8 million dot, but what about those who miss out? Think about the fear of losing this rare opportunity. You could be holding the key to financial freedom, but if you don't know what you have, you could lose it all. Don't let that happen to you. Now, the question is, do you have what it takes to spot this rare coin and cash in? Or will it slip through your fingers? In the next part of this video, I'll show you exactly where to sell your coin for maximum value and the shocking reason why so many people miss out on making millions. Stick around, because I'm about to reveal something that could change everything for you. Don't go anywhere. Have you ever looked at a penny, the one you tossed in your pocket or dropped under the couch cushion, and wondered, could this little coin be worth more than a fancy dinner? What if I told you that some rare pennies, like the 1984 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny, 
are valued at up to $1.7 million. It sounds crazy, doesn't it? But this penny could change your life. Keep watching because by the end of this video, you might just be checking your coin jar in a whole new way. Let's start with a story. You know, it's easy to overlook those pennies. We see them every day. Pennies in our change, pennies we see on the ground, and pennies we casually throw away. But some pennies aren't just spare change. They're hidden treasures waiting for someone who knows what they're worth. I in 1984, a minting error happened. A rare one that only a few collectors and coin experts have truly uncovered. The 1984 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny was made without a mint mark, and it's one of the most valuable pennies out there today. Now, you might be thinking, what makes this penny worth so much? It's just a small piece of copper, right? Well, not all pennies are made equal. A small mistake like this one can actually create a huge opportunity for you to profit if you know where to look. Now, let's dive into the real value of the 1984 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny. There are millions of 1984 pennies out there, but only a few dozen, maybe a hundred, were actually produced without the mint mark. This means these pennies are extremely rare. And, in the world of coin collecting, rarity equals value. This particular penny could fetch up to $1.7 million. Yes, you heard that right, $1.7 million. You might be sitting there thinking, how is this even possible for something so small, so old, and seemingly insignificant? Here's the thing, errors in coins create an incredible demand. Collectors are looking for these rare mistakes to complete their collections. And if you've got one of these elusive 1984 No Mint Mark pennies, well, you could be sitting on a fortune. Wait, 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 don't start running to your coin jar just yet. Not every 1984 penny is worth a fortune. The key to understanding this is recognizing what makes your penny different from the rest. So let's break it down. Here's the part that'll keep you up at night in a good way. Imagine finding this coin in your pocket change. You're at the grocery store and that penny falls from your hand as you reach for your wallet. You pick it up and for a second you wonder, could this be one of those rare million dollar pennies? The exact penny that could change your life. Now, let's talk about how to identify it. The 1984 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny will have No Mint Mark located on the reverse side, where you'd usually see a D for Denver or S for San Francisco. This small but critical difference is what sets it apart from the millions of other 1984 pennies floating around. If you happen to have one of these coins, the value is determined by a few factors, condition, rarity, and how many buyers are willing to fight for it. And here's where it gets really exciting. If you found this penny in perfect condition, say a mint state, your penny could command the highest prices. Collectors will pay handsomely for a coin that's as close to perfection as possible. But time is ticking. If you have this penny, or you think you might, don't waste time. The market for rare coins can change quickly. One minute, you've got a $500 penny, and the next, it's worth a fraction of that if the demand drops. So where do you start? How do you know if your coin is the real deal or just another penny that's not worth more than the lint in your pocket? Stick with me for just a few more minutes, and I'll tell you exactly what to do next to find out. Because let me tell you, the moment you know for sure could be a game changer. But before we dive into that, how much would $1.7 million change your life? Would you pay off debt? Travel the world? Retire early? Leave a legacy? I want you to really think about IT.in the next section. I'll share with you the steps to authenticate this rare coin and how to get it appraised by professionals. But first, let's talk about a few things you can start doing today to turn your pennies into profits before someone else finds them first. All right, if you've been paying attention, you now know the potential your 1984 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny could have. This coin isn't just a tiny piece of history. It could be your ticket to a new life. But time is of the essence. Coins like this don't just sit around forever. As more people become aware of their value, the market gets tighter. So don't waste another second wondering. Act now. If you're serious about turning those rare coins into real wealth, hit that subscribe button because I'll be showing you more secrets like this in upcoming videos. And don't forget to leave a comment below. Do you have a 1984 No Mint Mark penny? Share your story and let's build a community of collectors looking to turn pennies into millions. Imagine holding a penny in your hand one that could be worth millions of dollars. Sounds crazy, right? But it's true. 
What if I told you that a 1985 D-Mint Mark Lincoln penny could be worth up to $1.6 million? No, this isn't a joke. It's not some fantasy. The pennies hiding in your pocket could be your ticket to wealth. But here's the thing. They aren't easy to find. And if you don't act quickly, someone else will snatch them up. Are you ready to discover the hidden fortune in your change? Stick with me. By the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to spot a 1985 D. Lincoln penny worth potentially millions and how you can cash in on it. The 1985 D. Mint Mark Lincoln penny. You might think, what's so special about this coin? Well, this penny is unlike anything you've ever come across. A minting error turned this seemingly ordinary penny into a rare treasure. In 1985, the Denver Mint produced a batch of pennies with a very specific error that makes them incredibly valuable. These pennies were accidentally struck with the wrong die, creating a rare variation that's incredibly difficult to find. Most people overlook these coins because they look almost identical to any regular penny. But that's where you need to pay attention. The difference is in the mint mark, and if you spot one of these rare pennies, you could be looking at a windfall. But let me tell you something. Most people miss these coins because they don't know what to look for. Do you want to be one of them? Or do you want to be the person who finds a fortune? Here's the kicker. The last known sale of a 1985 D-Mint Mark Lincoln penny in perfect condition? It went for an eye-popping $1.6 million at auction. Yes, you heard that right. $1,600,000. That's life-changing money. So what do you think? Does this sound like something you want to be a part of? Time is of the essence. This isn't something you can wait on. If you don't act fast, someone else will find it first. Your next step? Learn how to identify the 1985 D-Mint Mark Penny and spot it before someone else does. Okay, let's break this down. You're probably wondering, how can I tell if my 1985 D-Penny is worth anything? First, take a close look at the mint mark. It should be located on the reverse side of the coin just below the date. The D should be clear, but not worn or damaged. A worn or damaged mint mark can drastically decrease its value. But when it's clear, that's when you've found a rare gem. But here's where it gets tricky. Finding a penny in perfect condition is rare. The most valuable 1985 D pennies are in uncirculated, pristine condition. So what does that mean for you? It means you need to check your pennies carefully. And no, we're not talking about the pennies in your spare change jar. We're talking about the ones tucked away, the ones you might have forgotten about, the ones you haven't looked at in years. Could one of those be worth millions? Absolutely. Honestly, who knew your old piggy bank could be a gold mine, right? Maybe it's time to empty it out and get serious about those pennies. Now, once you've found a valuable penny, the next step is knowing how to sell it. There are auction houses, coin dealers, and online platforms where these rare coins are sold for top dollar. But here's the thing. You want to make sure you're dealing with trusted buyers. You don't want to get scammed or sell it for less than it's worth. Take your time, do your research, and make sure you're getting the best deal possible. Imagine standing at an auction, watching your penny sell for over a million dollars. It's not just a dream. It could be your reality. But only if you know what you're doing and act fast. Now, there's one more thing you need to know. A secret that only the most successful coin collectors and sellers know. A strategy that could increase your chances of selling your coin for top dollar. But I'm not giving that away just yet. You'll need to stay tuned for my next video, where I'll reveal that secret and show you exactly how to maximize the value of your rare pennies. Will you let this opportunity slip through your fingers? Or will you be the one to cash in on millions? The choice is yours. Are you sitting on a hidden treasure worth up to $1.5 million? Sounds unbelievable, right? Well, today, I'm about to reveal a rare coin that could change your financial future forever. The 1988 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. If you think pennies are just spare change, you'll want to keep watching because what I'm about to share will make you look at those pennies lying around your house in a whole new way. Now, let's set the stage. The year is 1988. It seems like just yesterday, right? But what you might not know is that in the midst of all those regular pennies, something truly unique happened. A handful of 1988 Lincoln pennies were struck without a mint mark. You're probably wondering, 
What's the big deal? Well, this tiny detail or lack of detail made these pennies incredibly rare and, in some cases, worth up to $1.5 million. Can you feel the excitement? This isn't a dream. It's happening right now. People all over the country are finding these rare pennies, selling them for huge amounts, and living the life they've always wanted. And guess what? You might be one of them. But before you go rummaging through your penny jar, let's break down exactly why this penny is so valuable to so. How do these pennies even get that rare? And why does no mint mark make such a difference? Well, let's dive into the details. Stick with me because what I'm about to share will shock you. To understand the value, you need to know a little history. Every penny minted by the U.S. Mint has a mark, either the D for Denver or the S for San Francisco. But in 1988, a small batch of pennies left the mint with no mint mark at all. Just one mistake, but that mistake made these coins one of the rarest finds in modern American currency. Now, let's talk about value. What's a regular 1988 penny worth? Maybe a few cents if you're lucky. But a 1988 no mint mark Lincoln penny could be worth as much as $1.5 million. Yes, you heard me right, million. It all comes down to rarity. There's only a small handful of these no mint mark pennies out there, which makes them incredibly valuable to collectors. The fact that they weren't meant to exist is what creates the frenzy around them. When you have something that's so rare, demand skyrockets. And that means serious cash for you if you find one now. I can hear you asking, how do I know if I've got one of these million dollar pennies? Well, let's break that down. A 1988 no mint mark penny will look just like a regular penny in terms of size, color, and design, but the crucial difference is the absence of that mint mark. It's almost like the coin was never meant to be. So it's small, but it's mighty. But there's a catch here. Not every 1988 penny is worth that kind of money. So how do you separate the gold from the junk? I'm going to tell you in just a moment. Here's where the urgency comes in. Right now, the market for rare coins is on fire. Collectors and investors are looking for pennies like this more than ever. And the longer you wait, the more likely someone else will snatch up the opportunity to sell. Do you want to sit on a fortune, or do you want to take action and make that money work for you? Now, the question is, how do you turn that penny into a million-dollar payday? First, you need to get it authenticated. This is the critical step. Don't try to sell it without verifying its authenticity. You'll need a professional grader to confirm its rarity and value. Once it's certified, you can sell it at auction where collectors will pay top dollar. But here's the kicker. This is a limited window of opportunity. The longer you hold onto it, the more you risk someone else discovering its value before you do. So, if you're serious about turning your coin collection into a small fortune, now is the time to act. But hold on. There's one more twist to this story. What if I told you that even if you don't have the 1988 no mint mark Lincoln penny, there are other coins that could be worth even more? Don't go anywhere because in the next video, I'll reveal even more valuable pennies you might have sitting in your change jar right now. Trust me, you won't want to miss IT.so. What are you waiting for? Go dig through those old pennies, and who knows, the next million dollar coin might be in your hands right now. Make sure to like this video share it with your friends, and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on more life-changing coin finds. Thanks for watching, and let's turn those pennies into profit. What if I told you that a simple penny from 1993, something you probably have in your spare change jar, could be worth over a million dollars? No, this isn't a joke, and this isn't some crazy internet myth. We're talking about the 1993 D Mint Mark Lincoln penny. And right now, it could be sitting in your pocket waiting to make you rich. Stick around, because what you're about to learn might change your financial future forever, so let's set the scene. You're at home, flipping through some old coins, maybe clearing out that forgotten drawer where pennies from the 90s are collecting dust. You stumble upon a 1993D mint Mark Lincoln penny. At first glance, it looks just like any other penny from that year. But hold on, this coin is hiding a secret a secret that could change your life. You see, in 1993, there was a major minting error that made a handful of these pennies incredibly rare. And some of these error pennies are worth a small fortune today, up to $1.4 million. A single penny worth more than your car, your house, or even an entire vacation home. 
So why is this penny so valuable? What makes it different from the rest? Let's get into it. The 1993 D penny you have in your hands could be one of the few that were struck with a unique minting error. It's an issue that many collectors and coin enthusiasts call the double die obverse error. Basically, this happens when the die used to stamp the image of Abraham Lincoln on the penny is misaligned, causing the design to appear doubled, sometimes even tripled, on the face of the coin. You're probably asking, how can I tell if my 1993 D penny has this error? Well, it's not as simple as just looking for a blurry design. This is a subtle yet incredibly valuable mistake. If you look carefully, you might notice that the date, the word liberty, or the motto in God we trust seem a little off, not just blurry or worn, but doubled. This tiny error can make all the difference between a penny worth one cent and a coin worth a million bucks. But before you get too excited, here's the catch. Only a very small number of these error pennies were actually made. The minting process was so close to perfect that only a few lucky collectors got their hands on them. Now that you know what to look for, let's talk about how to get this penny in front of the right buyers. Here's where things get really exciting and really urgent. The market for rare coins is hotter than ever. There are collectors out there eager to pay top dollar for this 1993 D mint Mark Lincoln penny. Some collectors don't even care about the condition of the penny, as long as it has the error. But you need to act fast. The demand is high, and these kinds of rare coins don't stay on the market for long. If you find that you've got one of these rare pennies, now is the time to sell. I can't stress enough how important it is to take action quickly. The longer you wait, the less likely it is that you'll get top dollar. Not every penny you come across will be worth millions. There are fakes out there, and not every 1993D penny is a hidden treasure. So, what's your next step? How can you be sure you've found a genuine one? Stay tuned because we'll dive into that in just a moment. Before we get to how to authenticate your 1993D penny, let me ask you something. How many pennies have you thrown away or simply ignored, thinking they were worthless? What if one of those pennies, just one, was worth more than you could ever imagine? I don't want you to miss out on a chance to change your financial future. So, how can you be 100% sure your coin is the real deal? Keep watching because the answer is coming up next. To authenticate your 1993D penny, you'll want to take it to a trusted coin dealer or use an online certification service. These experts can inspect the coin, confirm if the error is legitimate, and even grade its condition, which can make a huge difference in its value. But don't just take anyone's word for it. Make sure you're dealing with professionals who specialize in rare coins. The truth is, there are millions of pennies out there, but only a select few will make you a millionaire. Are you willing to leave your financial future up to luck? Or are you ready to take control of your wealth and start selling rare pennies for serious cash? Remember, every great journey starts with one small step. Your million-dollar penny could be just a coin flip away. So what are you waiting for? Check your change jar, search through your collection, and who knows? Today could be the day you find your fortune. Keep looking for those hidden treasures, and remember, your next big win is just around the corner. Have you ever looked at your change jar, picked up a coin, and thought, could this be worth something? What if I told you that one small penny from 1994 could change your financial future forever? I'm talking about a penny worth up to $1.3 million. Yes, you heard that right. A penny that could make you richer than you ever imagined. But there's a catch. If you don't know what to look for, you might just be sitting on a fortune and not even realize it. Stick with me, and I'll show you exactly how to spot this hidden gem and how it could change everything for you. You're flipping through old coins, maybe from your grandfather's collection, or even just some spare change lying around your home. You pick up a 1994 Lincoln penny. It looks like any other penny, doesn't it? But here's where things get interesting this penny with no mint mark could be a game changer. Now, before you throw it back into your coin jar, let me tell you something crucial. That penny without a mint mark, the one you're holding in your hand, could be worth up to $1.3 million. How, you ask? Well, I know what you're thinking. A penny, $1.3 million? Is that even possible? It sounds unbelievable, right? But it's true. And here's the twist. This rare penny was never supposed to exist in the first place. It's a product of an error at the U.S. Mint, 
and not knowing how to identify it means you could be losing out on a fortune. Let that sink in for a moment. Now, time is of the essence. With rare coins like this one, the longer you wait, the more likely someone else will snatch it up. The window of opportunity is shrinking by the day. So, if you have a 1994 penny with no mint mark sitting in your collection, don't let it collect dust. You might be holding on to something that could change your life. Now, let's hit pause for a second. Picture this, you're going through your old coins and you find a 1994 penny, but guess what? It's got a mint mark. Don't panic. No need to throw your change jar out the window in frustration. It happens to the best of us. But don't worry. I've got you covered, so how can you tell if your 1994 penny is the one worth up to a million bucks? Here's the deal. Normally, all pennies minted in 1994 should have a mint mark, either in D for Denver or S for San Francisco. But there's a rare mistake, the 1994 penny with no mint mark at all. It was an error coin made in the Philadelphia Mint, but due to a minting oversight, they missed the stamp that should have been there. This tiny mistake turned it into a valuable rarity. Look closely at your 1994 penny. If it's missing that mint mark, don't toss it aside. Here's what to check for. The front, obverse, of the coin features Lincoln's portrait, and the back shows the iconic wheat stalks, which add to its value. There are no mint marks, no D or S just a clean surface. That's what makes it rare. But the value isn't just about the minting error. You'll also want to get it graded by a professional. The condition matters. Coins in pristine, uncirculated condition can fetch top dollar, with some reaching up to 1.3 million. Now, I know what you're thinking. How can a simple error be worth so much? The truth is, it's all about rarity and demand. And if you're still skeptical, stay with me because I'm about to tell you the crazy part. This isn't just some internet rumor. People have sold these coins for huge amounts. Let's dive into that next dot. Let's talk about real world proof. There are stories of people finding these exact 1994 no mint mark pennies and selling them for hundreds of thousands of dollars. Some have even hit the $1.3 million mark. It's not just a fantasy. These rare coins are in demand and collectors are willing to pay top dollar to add them to their collections. If you think this could be you, it's time to act fast. Don't just sit there hoping you'll spot a mistake. The sooner you take action, the better your chances of cashing in. You need to get your coin professionally appraised and graded. The higher the grade, the more your penny will be worth. Imagine what you could do with that kind of money. You could pay off your debts, take a vacation, or even live the lifestyle you've always dreamed of. It's all possible, and it starts with knowing what you have in your hands. This isn't just about finding a coin. It's about finding the key to a whole new life. And I want that for you. Before you go and check your coin collection, hold on. There's more you need to know. Because finding a rare penny is just the beginning. What comes next could be even more exciting. I'll show you exactly how to sell your rare coin for maximum value. But I'll save that for the next video, because you're going to want to hear every single detail. Trust me, you don't want to miss it. What if I told you that right now, in your pocket, you could have a coin worth over a million dollars? Sounds unbelievable, right? Well, keep watching, because in the next 10 minutes, I'm going to reveal a rare penny that could be worth more than most houses. And trust me, this is no gimmick, no clickbait. It's real. A 2008 Lincoln penny with no mint mark that could change your life forever. If you have one, you may be sitting on a fortune. But do you know where to look? Let's start with the basics. 2008. The year a mistake happened, one that would make certain pennies worth a fortune. The U.S. Mint, in its usual precision, made an error. They accidentally released a 2008 Lincoln penny with N.O. Mint mark. And what's crazy about this error is that it went unnoticed by the general public for a long time. Most people dismissed it, thinking it was just a regular penny. But this coin, in certain conditions, is now worth up to $1.2 million. Yes, you heard that right, million with an M. Now, imagine this scenario. You're standing in line at your local coffee shop, and a penny rolls your way. You pick it up, maybe toss it in your pocket, and forget about it. But what if that penny was a 2008 no-mint mark? What if that penny had the power to change your life? That's the reality for some people today, and I'm here to tell you, it could be your reality too. So, what makes this penny so special? 
well, it's the lack of a mint mark. You see, most pennies made in 2008 had either the D mint mark from the Denver mint or the P mint mark from the Philadelphia mint. But there was a small group, very small, that was made without any mint mark at all. This oversight by the U.S. Mint is what gives these coins their incredible value. And you can bet that if you find one of these, it's a golden ticket. Before you go digging through your change jar thinking you've struck gold, let's slow down a bit. I know what you're thinking. Is this for real? How do I even know if I have one of these pennies? Don't worry, I've got you covered. We're diving deep into the specifics, but hang tight. We're getting to the juicy part soon. Trust me. The hunt, how to identify the rare 2008 no mint Mark Lincoln penny. Now, here's the most important part. How do you actually identify this rare penny? It's simple, but it requires a little bit of attention to detail. The key thing to remember is that the 2008 penny with no mint Mark will be in the same size and design as any other Lincoln penny. What makes it stand out is that blank spot where the mint Mark should be. If you're familiar with pennies from 2008, You'll know they usually have a D or a P under the date, but this one will be clean. No mint mark at all. Here's where the fear factor comes in. What if you've already thrown one of these away without knowing its value? That's the scary truth. There are thousands of these rare pennies sitting in circulation, and most people have no idea. It's like searching for treasure in a sea of change. But don't let that fear paralyze you. Take action now, and you'll be ahead of the game. So now that you know what to look for, where do you start searching? I'll tell you this. Don't stop at your wallet. Check your loose change, your spare change jars, the bottom of your purse. Check old coin collections you've inherited from relatives. You never know where these rare pennies could be hiding. And remember, every penny counts when it comes to making money from home. But this one, this could be the jackpot you're waiting for. And I know, I know you're wondering, but how do I know it's worth a million? Don't worry. We'll get to the exact values and how to sell them for top dollar in just a minute, so don't go anywhere. Act 3. The payoff? How much is it really worth and what you need to do next, all right? Now for the big question. How much could this coin really be worth? Well, it depends on a few factors, including its condition. The value of a 2008 no-mint mark penny can range from hundreds of dollars to well over a million, depending on how well it's been preserved. A coin in mint condition meaning it looks like it just came off the minting press, is worth up to $1.2 million. That's no exaggeration. But even a coin in less than perfect condition could still be worth a substantial amount. Let's break it down. If your penny has even slight wear, it could still fetch a few hundred dollars at auction. But if it's in pristine condition, collectors could bid on it in a frenzy. The key is knowing exactly what you have, and that's where things get exciting. The urgency. Prices are climbing fast, and these pennies are disappearing off the market as more people realize their worth. Don't wait. The time to act is now. The next step is simple. Get your penny evaluated. Don't just assume that because you have a 2008 penny with no mint mark, it's automatically worth a fortune. You need a professional appraiser or to get it authenticated through a reliable coin grading service. These experts can confirm the authenticity and value of your coin ensuring you don't miss out on that windfall. And trust me, once it's graded and authenticated, the real bidding wars begin. You might even have collectors lining up to pay top dollar for it. But here's the thing. Even if you don't have a 2008 no mint mark penny right now, don't give up. The world of rare coins is vast, and there are many other pennies, quarters, and rare coins out there that could be worth a fortune. So keep searching, keep learning, because there are treasures waiting to be found, and with the right knowledge, you can turn those finds into a fortune. And in my next video, we'll uncover another hidden gem in the world of rare coins. Trust me, you won't want to miss it. So, hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell notification, and get ready for even more wealth-building tips and tricks. Your treasure hunt is just beginning. 11.25 a.m., November 16th, 2024. We're diving into a rare treasure, a coin so valuable it could be worth up to $1.1 million. Sounds unbelievable? Stick with me because if you've ever held a penny in your hand, you might be sitting on a fortune and not even know it. What if I told you that one little mistake, a flaw in the minting process, 
could make a penny worth more than a car, a house, or even a year's salary. And it's not a secret. It's out there, and you could be one of the lucky ones who finds it. You ready to learn about the 2014 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny? The rare coin that could turn your collection, or even your pocket change, into a life-changing amount of money? Let's get started. Now, before we go any further, let's break this down. You're probably thinking, how is a penny worth so much? You're not alone. Most people have no idea how powerful a rare penny can be. But the 2014 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny is no ordinary penny. In fact, this coin is a rarity that could slip through your fingers if you don't know exactly what to look for. In 2014, the U.S. Mint made a huge mistake. Some pennies were struck without the mint mark, a tiny D or S, that typically tells you where the coin was produced. Without that mint mark, the 2014 penny became a one-of-a-kind anomaly. And that's where the value skyrockets. Why? Because only a few of these no-mint mark pennies were released into circulation. They're extremely rare, and rare coins, well, they fetch prices that most people could never imagine. And here's the best part. They're still out there. These coins could be sitting in your change jar right now, or perhaps hidden in a drawer, completely unnoticed. But how do you know if you have one? Now that we've got your attention, let's talk about value. A typical 2014 penny with a mint mark is worth, well, a penny. But if you find one without a mint mark, depending on its condition, you could be looking at anywhere from several hundred to potentially $1.1 million. Yes, you heard that right, $1 million. So how do you spot a 2014 no mint Mark Lincoln penny? First, check the front. Look closely at the date, 2014, and the absence of a mint mark. There's no small D or S anywhere around the bottom of the coin. But it's not just about the mint mark. You'll want to examine the overall quality of the coin as well. The higher the grade, the higher the value. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70. A coin with a perfect score or one that's close can command a price that's off the charts. Coins in mint condition could fetch you over $1,000, but if yours is in perfect condition, don't be surprised if it's worth over a million dot and before you get too excited, you'll want to get it professionally graded to confirm its value. Otherwise, you could be missing out on a small fortune dot so what do you think? Could you be holding on to a small piece of history? Now, I know what you're thinking. How could I be so lucky? And hey, I get it. You've probably heard of people finding rare coins in their grandmother's coin jar or in an old purse they haven't touched in years. Sounds too good to be true, right? But hey, what's the worst that could happen? You find a penny in your drawer, and if it's not worth millions, at least it'll be worth a few minutes of excitement, right? All right, let's get serious. You're probably wondering, where can I find one of these? How do I get my hands on a 2014 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny? Here's the truth. Finding one isn't easy, but it's not impossible either. These pennies aren't just sitting around on every street corner. They were released in small numbers and they're rare, yes, but they could be in circulation right now. And if you find one, you'll need to act fast. Rare coins like these have a shelf life. Once they're discovered by the public, the price can drop. If you're holding one of these rare pennies, the window of opportunity may be closing sooner than you think, so here's your challenge. Look through your coins, check your change, Inspect that jar of pennies your kids probably left in the kitchen drawer. Could be there, quietly waiting for you to recognize its value. And what happens next? You'll either be holding a rare piece of American history, or you'll be kicking yourself for not checking sooner. But wait, don't leave just yet. There's something I need to tell you that might make you think twice before tossing any more pennies into that JAR.IN my next video. I'll show you another rare penny. This one could be even more valuable than the 2014 No Mint Mark. You won't believe how much this coin could be worth. So, if you're serious about cashing in on old coins, you're not going to want to miss it. Remember, folks, timing is everything. Don't wait. Check your pennies now and start turning your old coins into your path to financial freedom. Thank you for watching, and if you found this video valuable, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more, and share this video with anyone who needs a little luck in their lives. Who knows? Maybe you'll be the one who finds the next big thing.